Okay. Uh, how do we find out which ones we have and which ones we don't have? Oh, well, let's start at the tower, because I think there's one on the... that you can see from the top of the tower. Well, most of them are not in... most of them are not here. I should have looked at what I had and what I didn't have. Okay, so the ones I have are all in town. Perfect. Uh, so which ones aren't in town? Maybe... Well, this one to start with, at least. How do I get up here? Do I just climb the tower? Nope. Let's see. See. That's the next one? No. So I have no idea where that is. It's in a forest somewhere. These guys are gonna run pretty fast. Back off! Back off! Back off! Okay. 
I really like Sora's new look. Like, when I go into second form, it looks weird now. Kingdom Hearts 2 Sora looks weird. Compared, I'm very used to this now. Thanks for the follow. Uh, yes, the archive of the entire stream will be put up on the HBOS site uh, and YouTube. Uh, I'm working on getting the first part edited and up uh, soon. I was hoping to get that done before uh, filming this, but it, I had to fix it. There were a couple things wrong with the edit, so it delayed it. And then, uh, yeah, they should go up on the... S they might hit YouTube first, just because of how easy it is to put it on YouTube. Uh, but it'll go on the HBOS site shortly after YouTube, with the whole marathon being up within a month or so from now. Uh, hopefully sooner. But on average, at least a part a day would be my guess. And uh, if it's not all up by the time I move to my new place, I should have the fastest internet that I've ever, ever had. Yeah, no, I, uh, I found out a bunch of a bunch of the last parts of the marathon are missing from the YouTube archives from the live stream because apparently they never got streamed there. Something broke in the in the stream, but I didn't notice because it was going to Twitch and it was really the only one I was super paying attention to. But I wasn't too worried about that, because the plan is always to, was always to have uh, the edited, higher quality versions going up to YouTube and to the HBOS site. for you. Okay, this is looking starting to look closer to what I'm looking for. Yes, yeah, look this is the area. Excellent. Hey, 
Let's see. 55. Only five more. Okay, if I were to need to get out of here, where would I go? <laughs> I knew I knew I'd get turned around. Alright, just fly straight and true. And walk and fly into an invisible wall. Can't use magic when I'm free running. Back off. Back off. Back off. Go. Wait a second. Where am I supposed to get the the synthesis material for? Oh, probably the photo missions, isn't it? Shit. For upgrading, like, where do I get? Where do I get adam more adamantite? In Damascus. That'll be something I'll look up in in between. Oh, my stupid photo missions. No, I don't know. I just wanted to save. I do want to go to the wetlands, okay. Back off. Back off. Where are all the battle gates in this area, anyway? A bubble shield? Is that what my problem is here? Good job, Donald. That. Oh, still lantern. There are no formal marathons planned, but I, I think I wanted to play through the Wolfenstein, uh, the, all the new Wolfenstein games. It appears in gummy space, misty dream, and the eclipse, like just like randomly. Hmm. Is this the right way? Am I going backwards again?
path would suck to climb. Quite a hike. It's kind of interesting seeing these worlds actually flow together properly without being interrupted by cutscenes and, and stuff. So yeah, I kind of had no idea how this world fit fit together. All right, let's... I think we're ready to start looking for... Oh, I missed one. There was one back in some caves somewhere. There also appears to be one right before this bridge. I think I have a lot of Wellspring Crystals. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, so maybe we're we're not gonna we're gonna try not to go back for the one we missed because that one could be a ways away. I'm not even sure. I'll try and find all the other ones in the town. And hopefully that's enough. I think we only need four more. Yeah. I bet we'll find some ingredients around here. Nice picture, Sora. <laughs> oh, it was right here. Oh, I have that one already. Let's see. Nice picture, Sora. Where is that? Oh, okay, it's right here. That was easy. Let's see. Oh, I got the oh yeah, we, we got that one. I think we got that one. Which I believe is. Wait, can we can we dive here? No, diving's only a pirate yeah. thing. I think we got the one up here already. Check just in case. Let's see. Yeah, we definitely did. Okay, is that it? So if I'm only missing one here, then... Ugh, stop taking pictures. Let's see. No. Okay, there we go. There, I'm missing one. Alright, well, we're gonna forget about that one. We're gonna go to Monstropolis. But were there no uh, battle gates there? I didn't see any, but there must be somewhere. I'm not even sure. I'm looking at the picture and I'm not even sure what I'm looking at right now. Oh, I see it. It's on the clipboard. Okay.
I mean, we shouldn't need very many. Sure, it's bad. Sure, we sh should not need very many. I think it's, yeah, only one or two. Maybe three? How do I get to the, the floor? Come on, fellas! Okay, uh, we got the one underneath the the thing. Yeah. Oh, where is that? Oh Jesus! Whatever. Yeah, I maybe. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to have to do this thing, aren't I? Okay, he was super slide through as well. Take us right back to the lab floor. Yeah. Uh. 
Shit, was I supposed to do that? Or did I miss what I was coming for? Will that take me right back to where I wanted to go? Remember the elevator. Let's see. Hmm. Back off. Back off. Thunder. Try this. Oops. Wow, that time is very, very strong. Fire's been out for a while. Back off! Back off! Hey, I think that's a lucky emblem. Yeah? yeah. Oh, I see it. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Got it. And that's sixty. Number eight, huh? Well, let's try it. Oh, no! You again?
This has got a lot of health. And it's got a lot of defense, too. Oh, yes! Look at that damage. That's a lot of damage. Piece of cake. Uh, okay. The real organization. Xehanort seeks to gather 12 vessels, which together with his true actual self, he considers the real organization 13. Now that he has the numbers he needs, Demix and I are, treat are being treated as reserves. Several others who serve Xemnas in the old organization have followed the same course as mine, electing to abandon their newly restored humanity and rejoin the real organization as nobodies. But not Xemnas. Xemnas cannot exist in the present because there is already a Xehanort here. The old man in charge. The old man's humanity prevents his heartless and nobody, others vanquished in the past, and his younger self from being denizens of this time. To circumvent this, Xehanort is using the prototype replicas I created in the past as containers. Plucking his other self's hearts from the times that they existed, Xehanort ordered me to refine the prototypes to make them closer to, to the real... to. Make them closer still to the real thing, perfecting my creations so that they may house true flesh and blood humans suits my own purposes as well. All that remains for my atonement is to devise a way to pass on as many vessels as I can to those who truly deserve them. Okay, so here's his redemption arc. His redemption arc is in the is in the bloody arc is in the Don't bloody worry, things. The, the secret reports. Okay. All right, I feel slightly better about that than it just being like, I switch sides because, eh, reasons. Oh, I don't care about Lucky Emblems anymore, by the way. I'm just kind of looking for a save and fight, slowly fighting my way out. Oops. Zora. All right, let's see the secret ending.
Okay. Sora. Very reminiscent of the oh. first secret movie. The way it's being shot. Is Sora gonna end up in a Final Fantasy world? Doomed to live his life in Final Fantasy? Shit. Oh, good. Riku's here, too. Oh, my God. Okay. Sora and Riku in a humanish city. 104. Oh, Jesus. Not 104. real Final Fantasy character or one of the fake ones from the fake thing? So what, does the next Kingdom Hearts take place in... Oh god, no, let's... Oh god. Reconnect, really? Hmm... They did say that he, Young Xehanort did say that this would be, you know, the end of Sora in this world. So maybe he's got to move on to the next world, which is that hyper, that realist. I don't know. Hmm. Either way, obviously not the end of Sora. Not really sure what to think of that. That's, uh... This was far more interesting, to be honest. Hmm. So yeah, um... This was, this was a good game. It's hard to rank it, but I think if I had to rank it... Below 2... It's hard, so hard to beat 2, especially the Final Mix version. And nostalgia's, the nostalgia's hard on that. Uh, but it's definitely better than Kingdom Hearts 1, all around, um, I think. The gameplay in it was good. Um, there's some things in the gameplay that are weird. I gotta try. I gotta play through it on proud mode to really get a feel for how challenging it can actually be. Uh, then obviously playing through the rest of these memory uh, or these. Um, I guess before I start a proud mode run, I should finish. Should try to find all these battle gates. Maybe let's find a couple more of those before we call it. I'm just gonna look up. Let's look up the location of battle gates. Okay, so there's one in Twilight Town at the old mansion. So let's take on that. How many are there? Oh, there are 14 of them, huh? And which one destroyed me? Number... Number five, I think. Oh, 
Looks like there are two per world in the bigger worlds and maybe one in the smaller. So there are one or two. In each world. Hmm, Yazora. I mean, it's got to be the world that was shown in the... ...in the video game, because why else would it be called Yazora? There's a lot of nobodies. guys from I didn't you know they weren't even in this game at all cool there's a bunch of enemies potentially unique to just the oh shit that's got a lot of health Immune to magic? Not immune to the Dawn's Flare, though. Yep, don't seem to be immune to magic. In that case. My friends are yo yo's. Yeah. 
All right, Goofy, if you're if this doesn't finish it, my finish will finish it. So finish it, finish it, finish it. Finished it. Oops. All right. Notes on Subject X. Excerpt 1. Subject was found in the Central Square shortly after dawn. Female, approximately 15 years old. After seven days' observation, she spoke her first words but could not provide a name. Subject exhibits signs of profound amnesia and displays concern about what which world this is. Her words suggest that she departed her home world with others, although she cannot recall the names of of her erstwhile companions. All efforts to explore those memories have been met with re a rejection response. After his initial experiments on me, Anson the Wise ceased his research into the heart. His hand stayed by some fear I cannot fathom. Yet this new subject is like me, devoid of memories. Okay, this is Xehanort. Young Xehanort, or Terranort. Uh, she is a the perfect sample upon which to continue my master's work. She too could benefit from it. By traversing the heart, we have a direct path into memory. I myself have begun to reclaim my lost path past thanks to these very experiments. Who is she? Whence she whence has she come? These are questions no scientists could ignore. And the words she muttered, may your heart be your guiding key. Battlegate 4 is maybe the one I was getting wrecked by. It could have been 5, though. We're gonna just keep. I think we're gonna keep going until I have some real difficulty. Why did I save into slot 2? That was weird. Oh, I should see if I've... I've got some new abilities, and I've definitely leveled up a bunch since I last checked. That's pretty good. That's also really good.
Probably didn't use that on me, actually. Must have been five then that was the one that was hard. Or at least the one that I was losing at, let's not as I would call it hard. Wait, where did this take? This took me to some place. Other. Back off. Take this. Back off. Thunder. Hop on. Hey, second chance! I actually now second chance now. Now maybe I can not die to stuff. Super good. Okay, that's actually. So I have the combo breaker one, but now I can survive massive damage. Okay, got it. Okay, well, I think that's how that works. Okay. Experiments of the heart. Note on subject X, excerpt 2. Subject's memories have not returned, and our conversations remain less than lucid. But fragments can be gleaned to invoke a bygone world, like one out of fairy tales. Okay, so she's definitely from before time. As improbable as it seems, the question may not be from where she is from, but when. If she has truly crossed her time, the prospect of probing her heart is all the more compelling. My pilot studies used a handful of subjects, but none possessed the fortitude to endure them. Ultimately, all suffered mental collapse. I knew it would be a heavy blow to lose a subject as unique as she. Upon discovering the test I had been conducting, my master demanded that I cease my work immediately and destroy what research I had compiled. Worse still, he ordered the release of my remaining subjects. She is gone. Where is Subject X now? Has wise Master Anthem hidden her away? Whatever the case, I will not be deterred. I will take her place as the first subject in the grand experiment to come. 
interesting. All right, shall we try five again? Wait, so who is this? Do we ever figure this out? Who wrote this message? Oh, I should have equipped uh, second chance. That's my bad. The one? Shit. I did not expect that. Shit. Come on, Donald. Heal me. Thank you. Thank you. Fuck that. Focus siphon bullshit. Oh, 
Oh, I don't know if I want to rage form. Oh, I didn't use it. Good. Okay, whatever. Let's do it. This thing is the last enemy anyway. It was not the last enemy. Should have just that, that 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 is purely because I didn't equip second chance. Pfft. Hold on, what about my items? Did I really just, did I really run out of high potions? Apparently, I did. No recovery items. I don't want to go and get more. <laughs> so we're just going to take a bunch of Mega Potions. If I need them, I need them. Oh, that's so annoying. I was so close. Yeah. 
shit, I didn't use... I didn't save. One for me! I should really equip that magic safety thing. Space Ranger, you're back up, sir! Finally, I got one. I've been wanting to board one for a while.
we did it. Memoir, Excerpt 1. The castle was a wonderland to us children. Within its walls, Anson the Wise conducted his research, and the fruits, bore, fruits it bore allowed everyone outside to live in peace and happiness. That alone was enough to stroke our interest, though not all of the rumors that escaped its walls were so benevolent. By night, the muffled sounds of human wails emerged, and there was talk of dangerous human experimentation. Lee and I couldn't help but hatch a plot to steal inside and state our curiosity. The two who stood guard at the gates were researchers themselves, though you wouldn't think of it to see them, massive and barrel-chested as they were, and slipping past the duo was only the first hurdle. It proved, not on it proved one not easily cleared, and we, found we were found and tossed out on our ears time and time again. On the day we finally secured our entry, we descended the long spiral stair at the heart of the castle to find the dark space below it, lined with cages. There wasn't light enough to see if they were inhabited, and we were in no position to call out to any occupant inside, yet we could feel it, a definite presence. There in black, terror washed over us, and we immediately regretted coming. Just as we turned to flee, we heard the faintest of voices. The urge to run was nigh and uh, overpowering, but... Someone or something beckoned us on. There formed our tenuous sliver of light. By a tenuous sliver of light, we found her. Syax. Hmm. Uh, which way do I want to go? The other way. Yeah. Wait, want to see it? Hold on. So I'm looking for a cliff with caves, and then I'll turn right. But... Is this a cliff with caves? Maybe it's further along. Okay, here we go. Cliff of Caves. There it is. I 
think I'll do one or two more of these or until they get too hard. Probably just get six and seven and call it a call it a day. Get the other ones either on my own time or on another another time. It's getting late and I've got to get my sleep back to normal, normal-ish at least. Back on. Back um, on. thanks. Come on, you Goofy, you got his perfect shot for you. I'm done yet, huh? Oh? oh, we got it. one more.
Exert two. Was I too dim to make out her features? We spoke to her in hushed whispers. Who was she? Why she? Why? What, bleh. Why was she imprisoned here? She had no answers for us, but she had no memories at all. She was an enigma, but I knew I wanted to help her. So we continued our infiltrations. Most of them stopped short at the castle gates. When we did manage our way inside, we spoke with her. That was all the comfort two children like us could offer. But Lee had other ideas. He was determined to free her. We slipped into the castle that day knowing that we wanted with all our hearts to save her. But we did not find her inside that day, or the next, or any of our subsequent visits. Had she been moved? Had we simply imagined her? Lee and I knew there was only one way to be certain. And so we stood before the castle gates today, not as, as trespassing children, but in order to become Ansem the Wise, newest apprentices, Syax. Yeah. Alright, where's the other one in Corona? Spawn at the tower, okay, so it's definitely best to go back to the save point. Probably go buy items in two, but eh. Next time. Oh no. Uh, spawn at the tower, it said. Head through the cave and follow the path on the right until you reach the orb. It's only one star of difficulty, so it shouldn't be too hard. Okay, well, that's good news. Follow the cave and to the right until you... Mm. Should just be on this path, but I feel like we came this way before, and either I just missed it and wasn't paying attention, or... Maybe I didn't go right. Yeah, I definitely didn't come this way. So if it's in here... There it is. Back off! 
On the replica program and reanimation, following my erasure and my recompletion as a human, I did not awaken right away. Perhaps the damage was exceptionally grave. Even after waking, I remained in bed, pondering my next course of action. In my work on the replica program for the organization, I produced some 20 vessels. Most of the early results were failures. Not one of them granted a number. The first success to emerge was from that early lot was the Riku replica. Subsequently, Shion, number I, was essentially indistinguishable from a rep natural human, though she became unstable due to the influence of others. Using those two as my foundation, I worked to construct a number of nigh-perfect replicas, but just as they neared completion, my efforts were cut short. I suspect Xehanort aims to use both the initial lot as well as the unused replicas of my later from my later work. I rose today and decided to walk out to the square, my first outing in some time. Yet my stroll was interrupted when a surprising visitor appeared with an unexpected offer. Though younger than me, he had risen to become Xemnas' right hand, and I accepted his term and became a nobody once more. Easier to gain access to the to the old replica program that way. Whatever it takes to atone. Vexen. So he was he was a double agent from the very beginning. That's why there's no arc. Hmm, these are quite interesting. Should I try the next one? All the way in Monstropolis. Go to the service area of the door vault, seventh fast travel point, and outside the power plant. Oh, I, ha I already did that one. Yeah, I have eight. I already have eight. Nah. I'm gonna call it there, I'm tired. But we would, I will do the rest and I will read the rest of those reports and uh, I may even film doing it, but no guarantees. Uh, how the hell do I get to the safe point again? Did I not come from there? Oh, right, here, duh. Before I forget. Fine, I'll buy another Koopa coin. Just in case they eat out in these things. It's probably just like... I don't know, like 30? And then like... I don't know, like... 10 of those?
So when do I get to make ultimate weapon or whatever? Oh, save the queen and save the king. Need a lucid crystal. And some other stuff. Oh, um, let's just make one of everything. What did I run out of? Oh, wellspring crystals. in Twilight Town. Indeed there is, Zoro. Indeed there is. Let's go back there and save. That's it's a good place to hang out. May as well mail the postcard off. And yeah, um working on getting those first parts of the Kingdom Hearts 3 marathon uploaded. Uh, the first part is edited, and I can tell you there is very little gameplay in it. It is mostly all cutscenes. Um, but hey, I think it's going to be about an hour each. Just It's always worked. Did I have what I thought? Hmm. Let me just try and we brought some ingredients. See if there's any more cooking we can do. One new thing. Oops. Shit, what do I have to do? I, I forgot how to play this game. Sorry. This one's just timing. Oh, and I can't even make it again? <sighs> Whatever. Whatever. That is literally the one I've done the least. Probably, I think I've only done that one maybe once or twice before. Oh, 
Oh, Uncle Scrooge, you've done a pretty good job with your bistro. Made by, with foods made by rodents. I'm level 50 now. 51 even. Oh, I guess I could fix this. Oh, screw it. I'm going to turn that on. I don't know about auto-finish. Sometimes I don't want to finish. Thank you for joining me in the first part of the Kingdom Hearts 3 Marathon epilogue. We've watched this secret movie. Um, we've gotten a lot of these secret reports. We're starting to fill in some of the some of the questions that are yet to be answered. But still, there's many, many more. Um, all in all, I have very much enjoyed my time with Kingdom Hearts 3 so far. Um, finishing off these, these reports and starting a proud mode run and going through the whole story again with a greater sense of of what's going on and 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 what's important uh will be required to give it a full like playthrough or a full like the amount of times i played kingdom hearts 1 and kingdom hearts 2 especially um just to play it only once is not fair although i only did that with dream drop distance once as well although playing that again on ps4 i could see being fun because the main, main complaint of course with that was that it was on the 3DS, which, you know, there's a limitation to how much graphic fidelity and audio quality that you can pull off of that thing. Uh, and even doing it with a capture card and playing it off of a big screen, you know, I only go so far. But playing it off of PS4 on a big screen, uh, I just, just have to deal with the Dream Eaters again and all that crap. Um, but same with Birth by Sleep. There's a bunch of command boards and stuff in there that, that if you really 
want to get through all that game while well, you got to play some of that stuff. But, uh, for another time, there's a lot of Kingdom Hearts games out there to get through. If uh, I want to complete my play, my replay through, I definitely want to finish that Kingdom Hearts run I started uh, leading up to this marathon, though. So look forward to that in the in the near future as well, I imagine. So yeah, with that, see you tonight. Because it's like 3, it's almost 3.30 in the morning. Well, thanks for joining. See you next time on HBO.